Each year as we come to this service, I think of ways in which we can share the good news in new and different forms. Today I've chosen to do that again. And so I want to share with you a poem uh, based on and inspired by uh, the work of Dr. Zeus, Ted Giesel. Written in 1957, this is the new version, How the COVID Stole Christmas. Would you join me in prayer? May the words of my mouth and the meditations of each one of our hearts be acceptable in your sight, O Lord, our rock and our salvation. Amen. Every Christian on earth loved Christmas a lot, but the COVID of 19 loved nothing. He did not. The COVID hated Christmas, the whole Christmas season. Now, please don't ask why. No one knows quite the reason. It could have been that his viral intentions caused him to seize on Christmas abstentions. But I think the most likely reason of all may be that the COVID's heart was much too small. But whatever the reason, heart or viral disease, he despised all the Christians on their Christmas Eve. He looked down on them and their Christmas delight, and his cruel bumpy surfeits mocked them all night. He knew that the Christians were singing with joy, so with evil glee, he set out their joy to destroy. He growled, they're wrapping their gifts, their stockings are filling. He snarled, tomorrow it's Christmas that I will be killing. He declared in his tiny spherical form, I will keep Christmas from coming and maybe even send a snowstorm. They will sing all their carols and talk of their baby, but I will make them all sick and I don't mean maybe. Tomorrow I know all those good girls and boys will wake bright and early and rush for their toys. And then all that noise of theirs, oh that noise, 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 if there's one thing I hate, it's all that happy noise, 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 singing joy to the world, and come all ye faithful, and hark to their angels, and babe in the stable. They will stand all together, and at harmony's command, they'll sing out to God about peace in the land. And they'll sing, and they'll sing, and they'll sing, 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 and the more the COVID thought of all this Christmas sing, the more the COVID thought, I must stop this whole thing. For 2,000 years, I've put up with this now. I must stop Christmas from coming. But how? 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 Then his tiny and spherical head started spinning. With a horrible laugh, he said, why didn't I think of this in the beginning? His idea was awful, so wonderfully mean he would stop Christmas from coming through lack of hygiene. I'll sneeze and I'll cough and I, I'll spread my vile virus. And all of them will hide and give up every chorus. I'll dress up for Christmas. I'll ruin all they hold dear. They will give up and not celebrate Christmas this year. To countryside, village, city, and town, the COVID coughed, sneezed, and spread all his gunk all around. He slithered and slunk with his smile most unpleasant, from one house to another, he touched every single present. His plan seemed to prosper, his virus spread. Christmas seemed doomed by the spread of his dread. Boo-hoo, mocked the COVID as his sickness was humming. They'll find out now that no Christmas is coming. They will wake, they will shake, they will hide from each other. Their singing will stop, their noise will be over. Christmas dawned on the morning when it comes every year. The COVID was listening for the sounds of their tears. Their crying is a sound I must simply hear. And the COVID put his hand right up to his ear. And he did hear a sound rising over the snow. It started out low, then it started to grow. But this sound wasn't sad. This sound sounded glad. Every Christian on earth, the tall and the small, was singing with joy, socially distanced and all. 
He hadn't stopped Christmas from coming. It came. Somehow or other, it came just the same. And the spherical virus cringed at the sound of their joy as they smiled and danced, every girl, every boy. Christmas came without families together this year. It came just the same with gifts and great cheer. It came with the Christmas trees and the lights everywhere. It came with Zoom and FaceTime, songs and prayer. The COVID puzzled and puzzled till his puzzler was sore. Then the COVID thought of something he hadn't thought of before. Maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come all together. Maybe Christmas is in the heart and it's here now and forever. Maybe Christ in this mass is truly the reason that Christians gather and sing each year in this season. Maybe the angels, the shepherds, the wise ones from afar hailed truth born from heaven of Jesus Christ, their star. And then the true meaning of Christmas came through and the heart, COVID's heart grew and it grew and it grew. And now that his COVID heart didn't feel quite so tight and his viral cough stopped and his sneezing took flight, his heart grew three sizes that day, they all say, as he made it all the way to the babe on the hay. As he came to the manger, the newborn to see, he was masked, socially distanced, and on bended knee. And there with a smile, he started to sing to the ones the angels call the king of the kings. Welcome, Christmas. Bring your cheer. Let's all vanquish COVID next year, far and near. Then next Christmas, we will all stand once again, heart to heart and hand to hand. And Christmas Day will always be here and forever, as long as we have we. <laughs>